Welcome to the short book summaries channel if you are new to this channel kindly consider subscribing this channel to stay updated on each new book coming to this world. In case you like and want to buy this book the link is given in the description below. Now enjoy the summary. This program was previously published as Get Some Headspace, How Mindfulness Can Change Your Life in 10 Minutes a Day. Quiet the mind, feel less stressed and less tired, and achieve a new level of calm and fulfillment in just 10 minutes a day. Andy Puttacombe, a former Buddhist monk, the voice of Headspace, and the UK's foremost mindfulness expert, is on a mission, to get people to take 10 minutes out of their day to sit in the here and now. Like his readers and students, Andy began his own meditation practice as a normal, busy person with everyday concerns, and he has since designed a program of mindfulness and guided meditation that fits neatly into a jam-packed daily routine, proving that just 10 minutes a day can make a world of difference. Accessible and Portable, the Headspace Guide to Meditation and Mindfulness offers simple but powerful meditation techniques that positively impact every area of physical and mental health, from productivity and focus, to stress and anxiety relief, sleep, weight loss, personal relationships, the benefits are limitless. The result? More Headspace, less stress. Andy brings this ancient practice into the modern world, tailor-made for the most time-starved among us. Switch off after work. Fall asleep at night. Feel less anxious, sad, or angry. Control your cravings. Find a healthy weight. I really like how he writes, his conversational style, his sense of humor yes, he can be so funny, his deep yet down-to-earth and practical insights that are presented without being preachy. I found myself copying parts of it in my journal, especially when he talks about suffering in the introduction and how meditation doesn't change the way we feel about suffering, but instead it changes our, our experience of those feelings. Loss and sadness will always be there, but they will be perceived differently from now on. Beneath these feelings of suffering, of sadness, there will be a sense of peace, of stillness and of calm.